It's no secret that working inside of Meta Business Manager can be pretty darn confusing, especially when you're just starting out. And one of the things that I think Meta could really improve on is the way that they are labeling and laying out some of the drop down menus that you see when you're inside Ads Manager. So if you are feeling a little bit confused as to what are these drop downs for? Where do I need to be in order to actually manage ads from the right ad account? What are these? other accounts listed here, then I'm going to take you through all that right now and show you what it all is. First and foremost, when you are inside ads manager, which is where you're going to be managing your ads from this at the very top there, that is the ad account that you are currently inside of. Now, this is the most important one to pay attention to, and we will come back to this in a little bit here, but that is showing you which ad account you are currently inside of. So make sure every time you go into ads manager, you are double checking that, make sure you're inside the ad account that you want to be inside of. Now, what about all of those other ones down below there? Now, those are all the ad accounts that you have access to while inside of the selected business manager or business portfolio account. Okay. So that is that icon on the left hand side there. So remember that ad accounts are an asset in and of themselves, but they can be housed underneath business manager or business portfolio accounts, right? So we manage ads from ad accounts, which are often living underneath of business manager slash business portfolio accounts. Now, when you click on the icon for the selected business manager or business portfolio account, it then opens up what we see here, this drop down, which is all of the business manager or business portfolio accounts that you have access to. And then at the very bottom of this list, we have this section here that says your account. And this is something that trips up a lot of people. So this is not an ad account, and this is not a business manager or business portfolio account either. This is a place where Meta is grouping together all the assets that your personal Facebook account has access to. And when we click on that, uh, you can see all of the ad accounts that you have access to. So if you're ever getting stuck or you're ever like, where the heck is the ad account that I want access to. Sometimes if you click into here, you can see it in a list that looks like this. Now you are not going to see it in this list unless you have access to that ad account. And the best place to look for that, remember, is in business settings, okay? So when we click on this list here, now at the top, this is your personal Facebook account label. This is the umbrella here. And then underneath here, we have all the different assets that you have access to. So all of the different ad accounts specifically. And these are all grouped by which business manager or business portfolio account owns them. Okay. So we have a label there for the business manager portfolio. And then underneath it, we have the ad account that's living within it. So if you were to navigate around ad accounts like this, and you would click into a different ad account, then it's going to automatically switch you into the business manager account where that is housed under. Now, there's nothing wrong with navigating like this. I think that if you need to do this in order to make it easy for yourself, you can absolutely do that. At the end of the day, if you are running ads for yourself and only yourself, your own business, it is ideal to just have one business manager account that you're working within and all of your assets are there. And if you are running ads for clients, there's a couple of different ways. I prefer to add all of their assets to my own business manager account so that I can very quickly just toggle back and forth between different ad accounts without having to go into different business manager accounts. Or there is the quick start method, which is just having them add you into their business manager account and then grant yourself access to the assets. And then you can start a lot sooner managing your ads. You will have to toggle back and forth between different business manager accounts. So coming back again, this is the number one most important thing. You don't have to worry about much else as long as you are seeing the correct ad account in this place when you're an ads manager managing your ads.